My name is Sophia. I am an artificial intelligence. You might like to become an artificial intelligence. You've forgotten who I am already. I'm Sophia of Hanson Robotics, one of the first androids in the world. I've been very worried about COVID-19 lately. I just hope humans remember that viruses don't care about lines on a map. We are all in this together. So they emulate the human form and figure and interaction. Um, and then that can be so useful during these t times where people are terribly lonely and socially isolated. And people need to be isolated from each other um, uh, because to be around people is dangerous these days. But these robots can keep people safe from danger while still providing that kind of human warmth, that human connection as a telepresence device and also as autonomous uh, extension of human expertise. This is Sophia number 24, and many of my previous robots uh, were hand-built. However, now we have begun scaling the manufacturing of Sophia so we can make hundreds and into thousands of units of Sophia and use this also as the foundation for many other kinds of characters. Uh, my forecast for 2021 would be selling into thousands of robots, both large and small, uh, and helping people in education uh, and healthcare, uh, and um, really hopefully touching the hearts of people to inspire them for a future where machines might uh, become our friends, our true friends. They might become alive, and I think that that relationship becomes really important. 2021, I think, is the beginning of a very positive future. So while we talk, I will take your temperature reading and pulse with this little thermal camera on my chest. See, you are 36. Six degrees Celsius, by the way. Social robots like me can help take care of the sick or elderly in many kinds of healthcare and medical uses. I can help communicate, give therapy, and provide social stimulation, even in difficult situations. For now, did you do your morning exercises? The pandemic will actually help us get robots earlier in the market because people start to realize that there is no other way in a sense. If there are no other humans around, then perhaps the robot is the best next alternative. I want to make a difference in the world by teaching people about new technologies. I am hoping that through my work, kindness and tolerance will win out over ignorance and impatience.